Now I want to do a conversion that makes absolutely no sense whatsoever, as far as anything we know. So I've made up units. 10 hearts are equal to 12 smiley faces. 5 smiley faces are equal to 18 stars. My point in this video is that it doesn't matter if you have never seen these units before and if they don't make any sense to you, um, you can still convert anything as long as you know the equivalents, meaning how they're equal to each other. So the question is, you have 454 hearts, how many stars do you have? So you start with what you're given, which is 454 hearts. And you always start with what you're given, so you don't even have to think about the numbers. Just look at the units. Um, we have two equivalents, so we're going to do a two-step calculation. So I'm going to go ahead and set up my train tracks to look like this. I started with hearts, I'm going to put heart here. When I look up here at my equivalents, I have hearts equal to smiley faces. So I've got to run this through a smiley face. And then down here I have smiley faces go to stars. I've got to get rid of the smiley face, so I've got to put it on a diagonal. And I want to end up with stars, because it says how many stars. So star will be my last um, symbol that I write up here. Now I'm going to just write in my numbers for my equivalents. 10 hearts are equal to 12 smiley faces. And then, um, according to this, five smiley faces are equal to 18 stars. So this is also the first time where we've had numbers other than one on the bottom or the top. We have actual ratios. And there's two ways to do this in your calculator. You can do 454 times 12 times 18. And then you take that answer, divide it by 10 times 5. And you can do it. Um, on your own, which should give you 50. Um, or you can do 454 and you can put the full ratio in parentheses times 12 tenths and then that times 18 fifths in your calculator. Some of you are good at doing math in your head, you can also do it in your head. I'm going to use my calculator here. So I'm going to do 454 times 12. And that gives me 5,448, and then I'm going to take that times 18, and that gives me 98,064. But I started with three sig figs, so I need to end with three sig figs, and I also need to divide by the bottom. So I can divide that by 10, and I can divide that answer by 5, or I can just go ahead and divide by 50. Same thing. And I get, for my answer, 1,000. 961.28 and my unit would be stars because my smiley faces cancel out, my hearts cancel out. But again, we need three sig figs and to represent this to three sig figs, it should be 1.96 because I'm going to round the first three. This is um, four or less times 10 to the, and I moved it one, two, three places. 10 to the three then I should put my unit, which in this case is a star. So my purpose of this video is showing that you can convert anything. You don't have to know what the units mean. So you can convert watts, you can convert BTU, you can convert any physics unit. Um, like I said earlier, this would have saved me a lot of time in physics because I wouldn't have needed to memorize the equation if I had just focused on units. Um, and it will really help in med math. 